Welcome back. Welcome back. So I, I will admit we did try to film this video once and I ran out of memory on it. So take if you take two, if you're wondering why we're wearing different clothes and also uh, the, house the house looks is gone. <laughs> the house is gone. Now you know why. The laundry room is gone. Yay! All right. So uh, tell us, Kelly, what we're doing with the house. Well, renovate or demolish. We half and half. A nice little mixture. Okay. We tore off the whole laundry room that stuck out that was very, very creepy, if you remember what that looked like. And we're going to redo the bath, make it look a little bit more put together, add a patio, our hot tub, maybe a pergola. I still don't know what a pergola is. Jacob doesn't know what a pergola is. Sounds, I had to explain it to him. It sounds really expensive. Those CrossFitters, just, they just aren't smart. They just don't know and understand vocabulary, you know? <laughs> So yeah, so just imagine this looking a little bit better than it is in its current state. But that's okay, because we are remodeling it. We're, we're gonna remodel the rest of the house, okay? Like Kelly said, but we are demolishing the laundry room. It just wasn't really worth, it wasn't really worth putting money into it no. to like fix it up. Even to replace it was gonna be expensive. Bad. So we're gonna put the washer and dryer and the hot water heater in our master uh, closet. It's, and then it's actually pretty cool gonna make the closet like way bigger and take out those windows to do it and because the master bedroom is right over there with the little sliding glass door so, so. kelly will get a bigger a bigger closet which Woo! is a bad thing because then you feel the need to fill that closet it's still gonna be smaller than our one now so we're gonna renovate we're, we, so this is already taken off so you're gonna show the renovations of the house pretty soon uh one thing they have done the property other than that is they've started grading the properties you can tell Yay! and okay. we have a big giant pile Big old giant pile of trash we need to burn. Also, Chet's tomatoes are still here. So that's that's embarrassing. R.I.P. Chet's tomatoes. All right, so now that you know what we're doing with the house, we're going to take a look at the rest of the property because we got some other things we're starting on the property. The barn. The barn. Let's go take a look. All right, just to give you guys a heads up where we're going and where it fits in. There's the house back there. There's Clown House, okay? They just started uh, a gravel driveway that that we will use for not only Clown House, but also to go to the barn, but then this road will actually continue past the barn to Future House. To Future House, which is what I'm labeling the house I'm gonna die in. Because <laughs> I'm never building a house ever again. Yeah. So I'm gonna take a, a walk down this very beautiful yellow brick road. All right, to give you guys an idea where we're at, there's Clown House. Here's our driveway as it comes, and it keeps going and opens up into this big old wide open area. What are we putting back there, Kelly? Going to reside. <laughs> All right, so what are we doing? What's the size of it? What are we looking at here? Okay, imagine this. Dun dun dun. You come through the tree clearing. Oh, oh. It opens up into this beautiful, white, of course, large barn. It's going to have come up like this and then have a big peak at the top. Okay. And it's going to have two giant glass doors that are going to slide. Oh, hold open. on, hold on. What? What? Two b giant big what? Glass doors. I didn't stutter. So we're putting gla glass doors on my barn gym? Yes. I actually stole this whole idea from a wedding venue. Which is, I mean, which is kind of like, I'm not going to lie, which is kind of like our idea is why spend a lot of money making just a barn gym if we could also use it as a barn gym and possibly just a venue in general to use. Potentially. Yeah, Maybe. potentially. We'll see. Yeah. But it's going to be really pretty. It's going to be white think like very industrial um like minimal very how, how many other adjectives can you use like trying to give them a good feel for the for the vibe is rustic a good word no is modern a good word modern okay yeah <laughs> modern minimal like clean industrial <laughs> okay i think we're good <laughs> white white and black steel yeah okay green. so it's gonna be white in the outside Everything in the inside is going to be black. Well, the, the walls, everything is going to be white, but like the rig and the floor and like the finishes and stuff will be black. So black like and white, very black and white contrast. Very chic. Black, white, glass, and then like green plant. Picture it, that. Is chic a good word? Yeah, chic's good. Okay, so, continue. The cool thing will be the big peak in the middle and then the two glass doors and it'll have doors on both sides that open up lots of windows lots of huge windows on the sides so it's gonna be really really cool 
And then the driveway will basically just continue through that clearing and then that's where our house will go someday. So our driveway will continue on down there through that hole in the trees. I want to make a covered bridge someday. Kelly wants to put a covered bridge someday. I don't think I can afford that unless I sell all my kidneys. <laughs> someday. So they graded it. They've graded it. This used to be obviously a bunch of hay and it used to be sloped. So they've obviously flattened it and graded it. It'll be 50 by 70, be pretty large. We'll have one office, one bathroom. And now we need to hire a cleaning company to make sure it's always clean, right? Yeah, the bathroom's gonna be really cool too. I'm getting a really cool vintage, you know, uh, like pedestal kind of sink. Well, not pedestal, but so like one of those wall mount. When all you guys show up and have nervous poops, you can go to a really nice bathroom and poop in a really nice bathroom. You know, just making sure everyone's, <laughs> everyone's <laughs> taken care of. All right, so obviously we want to show you the fact that we are demolishing and renovating Clown House. The fact that our barn gym is going to be going right back here. Um, what else? What's next? What's next? Well, What's next? hopefully more renovating on Clown House because we are on a tight schedule. Um, and they're hopefully going to be starting the barn, what would you say, in a couple weeks? The thing we're waiting on that's taking forever is getting windows. Yeah. Um, just with the current state of the world right now, lumber, windows, all that stuff Expensive. is just really slow. Yeah. Um, so we're waiting on the windows, and I think once they get the windows in, we're ready to pretty much start the barn. We're going to roll in the barn, and then the goal is to get the house mm -hmm. finished before December 1st, considering we have to be out of our house by December 1st. So if they're not finished by December 1st, we're homeless. We are legit, legitimately homeless. <laughs> we'll find some place to stay. All right, guys. Well, hey, thanks for watching. If you have any questions or you guys want to see specific things going on on the property, um, especially the, the renovations, comment down below, and Kelly will make sure to get back to you. <laughs> All right. See cheers. ya.